Well, hello, friends. It's Rachel, dressed up as Intimate Alien. And I wanted to comment on some things about Intimate Alien because I've had some new experiences lately. Today, I had the first meeting of the Star Bean Club. And so I got to go casually, more casually than if I'm in a session with someone. Um, we went dressed up like this, and uh, we had the pleasure of spending time with two other beautiful star beings, and we just got to chat about like what it's like and what this does for our lives, and it's really remarkable how dressing up in an aligned way, right, we're not just randomly putting things on, we're kind of, it's like intuitive art for the face, we're being guided as to what is vibrationally accurate. And none of the other beings looked like me. They were all different, right? Unique to their own energy. But we all agree that we feel more powerful, more free, happier, more allowing, more relaxed, like this. It's totally contrary to what you think. You think this needs bravery or skill or whatever, but it's actually not true. You know, I feel more like me like this and that makes a really big difference as to how I show up in the world um, and how people respond to me I went like this to see Miranda Sings show on Saturday and I did the Miranda mouth I'll insert a photo here if you don't know what that means but Miranda Sings is a character that Colleen Ballinger created and um, has been doing for like, I don't know, 10, 12 years now, and this is how she makes her living. It's really remarkable, but again, here, that's how she makes her living. She started as a character, not necessarily a star being, but a character, and she says it's mostly based on herself, as she said in the show, and, um, it's kind of like a caricature of herself. You could say this is a caricature of me, right? I'm playing up my energy. I'm playing up the parts of my energy that I want to play up. And since Intimate Alien's always a part of me, that makes sense. That's totally accurate. But it gives us this sense of power and freedom and joy because we're not holding ourselves to our regular boundaries of fitting into society, of having acceptance based on fitting in. Gosh, it is so freeing. So I would highly recommend checking this out, whether you go like character route, star being route, whatever you call it, doesn't matter. Experiment, try it, dress up, like, I don't know, it's incredible. For someone who is, I am very naturally shy, I'm a very big introvert, but Ever since I was young, 12 years old, I started dyeing my hair different colors. First one was purple stripes. I actually almost got suspended from middle school for that. I had to convince my principal that I wasn't a distraction in class by going to all my teachers and asking them. It was really weird. But um, nobody was really dyeing their hair then, you know? There was like punky color. I don't even think Manic Panic was out yet. So I've been doing this a very long time. Uh, 25 years. Oh my gosh. 25 years I've been dyeing my hair. I should have a party. Um, and it's always done that for me. It's always made me feel more comfortable and more natural. I made a friend actually in high school and she told me at the end of this, the year that like, I never would have been friends with someone like you because of how you looked, but you've changed my mind about like judging people by what they look like because it's, I don't know, it's so natural. I think a lot of people wouldn't watch an alien, but she's so approachable, she's so normal. Um, go for whatever you wanna do, regardless of what the stereotypes are, regardless of what you think people might think or feel, because your feelings about it, your naturalness or your powerfulness in it is what is going to make the reactions. It's what is going to make it work. I didn't think this video was gonna be about this, but here it is. So, I love being this. I'm gonna be this more. I love going out in the world like this. 
So there is a vlog coming up where she's going to the Miranda Sings show, and it's just so fun. She just filmed her reaction to it, so that'll be in there. And uh, I, I love it. It's like, where can we go as humans? What is our next evolution of expression, of excitement, of feeling, of embodiment? This is part of it for me. We're here to feel enlivened. We're not here to survive. We're here to thrive. We're here to live. We're here to enjoy. We're here to be happy. And everything's taken care of when you move into the well-beingness instead of the, how can I get through this? It sounds contrary because we're not taught that when we're brought up, but the more I live that, the more I find that it's true. So anyway, random video, just chit chatting with you about this topic, being dressed up. And that's it. Okay. See you later, guys. Have a beautiful day. Oh, no, you can't.